All right, I'm back. So, I, <sighs> I'm reaching down. I have got some wax to share with you today. So, this is kind of a collective haul. I, over the last probably three weeks, maybe a month, I have been kind of accumulating some wax locally here in Oklahoma, where I live. Um, and I went to Walmart, picked up some new wax, some I've had before, I think. And then I also went to Ollie's and I picked up some wax from Ollie's, duh. And then I also, <laughs> y'all know me and my mom like to go shopping every weekend on Saturdays and we'll go to boutiques and just random stores like that and we'll find, um, sometimes people will be selling Scentsy bars. So I decided, I mean, I think I got, yeah, 10 Scentsy bars. I always feel like it's the jack, I hit the jackpot whenever I find Scentsy, like here, like locally, because I mean, it doesn't happen very often and whenever given the opportunity, I kind of try to take advantage of it. You guys can see I just haul, I'm uploading my Rose Girls order right now, um, but I'm gonna try to upload this next. But um, yeah, so I've got some Walmart, um, even the, uh, Ollie's is Walmart, and then I've got Scentsy and a few Goose Creek. So let's get started. I'm going to start with Scentsy first because I know some people prefer Scentsy. I'm going to grab from here and then put them back in and just kind of go from there. So this one is Pink Lemon Water. Um, I love this. I've actually never had a bar of Pink Lemon Water, but um, Brett and Brad were so nice to send me a sample of this and I absolutely loved it. And when I saw this, I was like, I'm go I'm getting one because I love it. It's just a very refreshing aquatic. I hate comparing this to like a rose water scent, but it's that very watery vibe, but obviously it's different. And then I picked up Coco Lime. This is a huge favorite. I remember getting this years ago. This is an old ass bar. I'm hoping this throws, uh, but it's amazing. I love Coco Lime. It's a very like sweet kind of tart, tangy coconut lime scent. Uh, I love it. Definitely stronger on the lime in my opinion, at least. I love that scent. It's perfect for summer. I also picked up Jammy Time. I'm sorry, you guys, my cow, that's not cute. Uh, jammy Time. I've never had Jammy Time. Like, how have I not had this? But it's good. Um, it's a very, like, laundry scent. It's fresh, clean, laundry. I actually am warming... I have a bar of fluffy fleece currently in my melting basket, which I like, but if I'm like judging on cold, I think I like this one a little more, but maybe not, we'll see. Uh, I picked up Amazon Rain, which is also a favorite of mine. I absolutely love Amazon Rain, oh my God. Oh, it's one of my favorites ever. It's just the most amazing aquatic, green scent ever. Um, it's a really good bathroom scent to me. Another new one to me is Tahitian Twilight. I've never had this one and it's really good. It reminds me of a scent I've had. I don't know what it is. It's sweet. It's a little feminine kind of, kind of fruity. I don't know what this is. It's almost like a toss up between like love spell and I don't even know. I don't know. It's, it's, it's good though. I don't know. It's good. I like it. A uh, very widely known favorite is Bonfire Beach, which I like Bonfire Beach. I mean, if given the opportunity to get a bar, I will. Um, it is a really good scent. It's pretty much just toasted marshmallow and salty sea air. And it's good. I really, really do like Bonfire Beach. But it's not, like, um, it's kind of a one and done for me. Like, I just need one bar kind of thing. I like it, but I don't love it that much. 
Um, pink leather is another one I've never had. Um, this is like really hard to explain. <laughs> I don't know. It's kind of like a sophisticated cashmere perfumey scent. Um, laundry a little bit. I don't know. But it's pretty. I like this. This is definitely a bathroom scent, a bedroom bathroom scent for me, at least, I think. Another new one I've never had is White Sands. I was dying to try this, and I don't know why I never got it, but I have it now. And I feel like people either love this or they hate it. I get why. I don't see this being a scent that... It's, it's almost to me like suntan lotion and sunscreen mixed with like sand. It's almost like golden kissed a little bit. I don't know. It's good. I don't see myself being like, oh my gosh, I need, you know, another bar of that immediately. But I'm, I want to try it. So I thought I would. And then I picked up Ruby Nectarine, which I love this. Ugh. This is so good. This is a mouth-watering, juicy, fruity kind of nectarine, I guess. Juiciness. Oh, it's mouth-watering. It's delicious. I love ruby nectarine. I'm so happy to have another bar of that. And then uh, lastly, I picked up graham cracker crunch, which is also a favorite. I love graham cracker. I used to not, but I do now. It's, I think it was because I was unsure how I felt about peanut butter and wax. And this definitely has a peanut butter scent to it mixed with like graham cracker and like honey or something. That's like the best way for me to describe it, but I like it. It's good. Okay. So that's it for Scentsy. I'm going to show you the rest. I'm going to just combine. I'm not going to try to like be super... Um, organized with showing you what I got from Ollie's and what I got from Walmart. I'm just going to show you all of it now, okay? So I picked up two Goose Creek melts. I actually didn't know until I, I saw these that they had Goose Creek at Walmart. And I haven't heard the best of things. So I'm kind of thinking these are going to be kind of a one and done. They may suck. I don't know. But I decided to give them a try. This is Cotton Vanilla Breeze. And um, I like this. I mean, it's good on cold, but we'll see how it does. Yeah, it's a nice cottony vanilla. I almost feel like I get coconut. I don't know, but it's good. So I'm going to try that. And then I picked up Old Time Lemonade. This is good. This is like a sweet, tart sugary zested lemon it's very spring summery it's good i like it we'll see how it does again i don't really have super high hopes for those um and i picked up some mainstays so this one i know i got at ollie's this is favorite denim and there is a price on there of 229 i really hope i didn't pay that much because that's like more than what they cost at walmart <laughs> This is Cotton Blossom, Floral, and Musk. And this is good. Um, it's kind of hard to describe. I get where they're going with the denim feel. It is floral. It's good. I like it. It's fresh. It's, it's nice. We'll see. We'll see how that does. And then I picked up Mainstay's Cabana Fiesta. This is citrus, melon, and dragon fruit. I feel like dragon fruit and passion fruit and those kind of fruity scents smell kind of weird. Like almost stinky on cold, but that note goes away. So I kind of feel like that's going to happen with this, but I'll let you know. And then I picked up Mainstay's Ocean Peony. This one is Bergamot, Rose, and Wood. Um, 
this is a really good name for it because it really is like a very beachy kind of peony floral. Um, I get this salty sea air feel. It's good. I really like this. Um, like I really, really like this one. So I got those. And then the rest of these are Sensationals, Better Homes and Gardens. So this is Mango Teakwood. One, <coughs> excuse me, thing that I really like wanted to go at in 2024 was getting more Walmart wax because I've always loved Walmart wax. I've always had such great performance from Walmart wax. I just, I love Walmart wax. So I'm really glad I had this, but I'm going to continue buying more. Anyway, Mango Teakwood says it takes two, and this is a part of the wood family. And it's, it's interesting because this does really have a woodsy mango scent to it. I'm almost getting like a Sandy Shore vibe to it as well. It's really good. Um, I think that'll be great for the summertime for sure. The next one is Sensational's Tiki Time. Tropical State of Mind. Part of the fruit family. This is okay. Um, I don't love this. It's definitely a like a fruity kind of beverage. I feel like there's that passion fruit or something in here. It's good. I like it. I don't love it, but I like it. It's fine. We'll see how it does warming. I will let you know. Better Homes and Gardens, Sea Salt and Sage. Blue Cypress, Sage, Bergamot, Black Pepper, Lavender, White Cedar, and Spice. This, I feel like, is a repackage. I don't know what it is. But it kind of smells like a lightly fragranced shaving cream. Like a men's shaving cream. It's so good, though. I love this. Yeah. Yeah. I feel like I'm getting, like, a shaving cream vibe to it. It's amazing, though. Love that one. Another one is Better Homes and Gardens Vanilla Orchid. So weird, I would never have thought I would love these scents, but I do. This is Honeysuckle, Violet, Rose, Hyacinth, Lilac, and Vanilla. This smells like your grandmother's bathroom. And she's like about to die because she's so old. No offense to her, but it's like she's so old. Like this is just an old person <sighs> scent. But <laughs> I really like it. I know that's weird maybe, but it's like a bathroom scent. It's really good. I really like Vanilla Orchid. Um, that one's nice. Pretty Please from Sensationals. It's a really pretty picture of the Eiffel Tower. Sparkling sugared berries. I disagree. Um, no, this does not smell like sparkling sugared berries. You know, it reminds me of Sugar Lavender Twist. Like, a lot. I don't know if I would say it's the same, but I don't know. Ugh. I really like this. I've been kind of going back and, and forth in my head. Like, is this Sugared Lavender Twist? I don't know. Somebody else let me know what they think about it. Okay, this is a classic lavender lemonade, Better Homes and Gardens. Lemon, sugar, pineapple water, lavender, melon, and vanilla. This is so, so good. I've loved lavender lemonade ever since they came out with it. It's so good. It's so good. It's a lavender lemon sugary scent. Um, there's something about lavender and lemon that just literally are a match made in heaven. Okay, this I got from Ollie's. Better Homes and Gardens, Stormy Indigo Seas. Bergamot, lemon, leafy greens, sage, patchouli, and mahogany. Now... This is your typical men's body wash scent. Like, it's definitely cologne. 
So if you don't like the, those kinds of scents, you won't like this. I like almost guarantee it. Um, but I like them in my bedroom and bathroom. I think it's just kind of refreshing. Coconut Cotton Blossom from Sensationals. This one is, it says Paradise Fresh. Part of the Fresh family, didn't show you, there you go. I really like this one. This is a, It is coconut, cotton, and floral. But it's sweetened up. It's like a little bit of a sweet floral. It's really good. I like this one. Very much. Okay. Better Homes and Gardens, Paradise Shores. Berries, melon, passion fruit, star fruit, grapefruit, and pomelo. This is good. It's like a very fresh, fruity scent um yeah yeah it's good i feel like this is gonna be nice warming we'll see i will let you know paradise shores another one from uh ollie's i picked up is from oak and rye this one is smell the rain this is definitely a laundry clean scent like for sure I wouldn't classify this as masculine, but it's good. I, another one, bed, bed or bathroom for sure. I will stick with one cube because I don't want to be blown away out of the house with that. Better Homes and Gardens, Raspberry Vanilla Smoothie. Raspberry Vanilla Cream and Sugar Cane. When I smell this, I think of unicorn cake, which I have in my melting basket. My cat's being weird. It smells like unicorn cake to me. It really does. I don't know. Oh, it does, but I don't know if I would say it's 100% the same. I don't know, you guys. I don't know. It's really good though, and I love unicorn cake. Okay, blueberry tart from Better Homes. Raspberry butter, blueberry butter pastry, and vanilla. I'm shocked at how much I like this because I feel like blueberry and wax is, it all smells the same. But I'm getting the other notes in here. I'm getting like the buttery pastry. It's really good. I don't know if this is a, a repackage or what. I don't know. This is really good, though. I really like that one. I was pleasantly surprised with that one. Okay, better, or Sensationals, Caribbean Clouds, Sea Salt, and Pineapple. I also disagree with this. Um, it's a part of the Fresh family. This does not have any pineapple in here. Like, <laughs> zero. Like, negative. No, it's very fresh, salty sea air, clean, a little masculine. It's good, I like it, but it, there's no way that there's pineapple in there. Like, they're lying. I'm sorry. Another one from Ollie's is Oak and Rye Raspberry Linzer Cookies. Um, I like this, but I kind of get a medicinal scent to it. On cold, it smells kind of cough droppy. So I'm hoping that goes away. I will let you know when it empties. But I, I based on the name, I was like, I can't, I can't not try that and see how it is. Last but not least, from Better Homes and Gardens, this I also got at Ollie's. It's watercress and lily. Lily petals, bergamot, jasmine, watercress, woodland herbs, and eucalyptus. Oddly, I love this. Like, it's so good. It's very, very crisp. It's fresh. It's crisp, watery, um, green, with a sweet floral, like, floating in the water. Oh, it's so refreshing. It's pretty. Definitely a bedroom, bathroom scent. I really look forward to warming that. It's really good. So that is everything I picked up from Walmart, random stores, Ollie's, you know, whatever. 
Um, I'm, I'm set for a while. What are you doing? He's trying, he, yeah, they're gonna wanna play with this. Watch, see? <laughs> Hello? You don't wanna play now? <laughs> Whatever. Anyway. That's it. I'm actually about to go get some new oils. I ran out of oils for my oil diffuser, so I'm gonna go get some of those. Run around town a little bit, enjoy my kind of day off, and I hope you guys have a great weekend. Um, I'm going down south a little bit with my mom. We're gonna get lunch at a cute little cafe and go eat. Oh, yes. This is... This is Teddy. This is the kitty that I kept. He doesn't like me to hold him much, but you love me so much. Yes, you do. <laughs> he doesn't like me to hold him, um, but mom, she doesn't care. Um, but anyway, that's it. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys have a great <laughs> weekend and I'll see you in my next one. Take care. Bye.